Back to that breaking news from the top of the show, a dog attacking a young child. Right now, that dog is still out there and the child is recovering. The six-year-old will have to receive several rounds of vaccination for rabies if the dog owner doesn't come forward to confirm the dog is healthy. NBC Charlotte's Rachel Brown joining us live now with the latest. Rachel. Sarah, it happened here at the Siski YMCA last night, and the boy's father tells me a dog jumped up onto his son and bit him in the face. Meet six-year-old Zach. Full of energy, loves to play video games, loves to play sports. Soccer happens to be his favorite. Zach had just finished playing here at the Y Monday night when... He saw a lady with a dog, and he asked her, he ran up to her, past me, and asked her if... Um, he could pet the dog and so we had to pause the interview. What happened next is hard for Zach's father to talk about. The dog jumped in and bit him on the lip. Just feet behind his son, he saw the blood and he heard the screams. I heard her say he's just a puppy. He didn't do anything wrong. Quickly, he rushed Zach to urgent care. Luckily, Zach didn't need stitches, but you can clearly see the scar that bite left behind. It wasn't until later Zach's dad realized he'd forgotten to get the dog owner's information. Because without proof the dog has received a rabies vaccination, Zach will have to undergo at least four rounds of shots to his face and thigh. We just want to know that the dog does not have rabies, so my son does not have to go through that procedure. And time is running out. Doctors urge Zach to get vaccinated ASAP, warning 10 days is the longest he can wait. We don't want money. We don't want any trouble. We're not mad. We just want to know how the, what the situation of the dog is with his rabies vaccine. And Zach's father tells me that dog was on a leash. He's just hoping the dog owner reaches out to him through Facebook, through the Siski YMCA, or through our Facebook page, NBC Charlotte. That's the latest here in Matthews tonight. Rachel Brown, NBC Charlotte. Rachel, thanks.